quiet Saturday morning at the keyboard. I often talk about how I don't like getting up in the morning to write. I, that's an early AM writing session for me never ever goes well. Uh, a lot of my best writing comes at like mid-morning, so like 10 a.m.-ish, 9, 10 a.m.-ish. That's when my best quality stuff usually comes out. Uh, often why I, I enjoyed my <laughs> my time on my sabbatical there, that, that those five months I had last year off. That was one of the big advantages I could actually write uh, mid-morning. But um, this morning, though, since I'm not necessarily working too much on prose, I was up and very relaxed and very comfortably was at my desk and yeah ended up getting some work done what you're seeing here first thing to kind of wake up is me going about and submitting some more short stories uh, i'm just clicking through um, different magazines on submittable <clears throat> and just finding ones that would be a good fit uh, a lot of the one of the big one of the challenges uh, of submitting for me is that my stories tend to be a bit more outside the word count range of most magazines um, or, you know, just any kind of publication. Usually they want something like 4,000, 5,000 words. My my shortest one is around like 5,000 words. Um, and they go, you know, it's between five and six usually is what I end up writing. Um, yeah, my, my, my stories tend to be a little bit longer. A little bit longer. Um, so, with that, that, that was a bit of a challenge, obviously, just going through this morning, looking for them. But overall, a very, very kind of quiet, relaxing day. Uh, after that, I went through and did some passes on the blurb. That was, again, simple stuff. Um, nothing of this requires, like, nothing... Of what I'm doing now requires like a great, 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 great focus, and so it is kind of relaxing. It, it is, it is one of those things where I, I'm kind of happy in a sense that I don't have to stress stress out, stress out too much about this stuff. Um, just going through and getting these things done is is perfect. Um, and again, just it's not something that requires me to be fully awake. Even recording this video right now, I'm not fully, fully, fully. I don't think up yet. But with that, that does bring up, I suppose, a, an interesting scenario, though, which is, can I now begin to work earlier in the morning? Uh, today, today was a very, very kind of calming experience, and I, I've begun to question whether I could actually, at least in the short term, at least for the next maybe month, couple months, basically, start getting up early and start doing my sessions first thing in the morning now. Um, it, it's interesting and I, I'm something we'll be thinking about probably next day or two thinking about because if I can if I'm not dying to write this sort of perfect prose if there's no stress and no pressure on me in that sense you know why not do it in the morning why not why not get it knocked out of the way now um, things like paperwork the financial stuff um, getting this blurb done a lot of this stuff does not require me to be at like the optimum mental capacity. Uh, it requires me to be awake and to be, yeah, yeah, you know, like not not extremely tired, but like just a re regular kind of like morning sort of like, you know, haze. That's, I, I can do this work with that. And so I, I've begun to consider maybe making these early sessions a permanent thing for at least the next couple months. We'll see what happens, but Today, today went well. It was very calming, and again, it was just something, something kind of serene about this. I, I mentioned a couple of days ago about the panic attacks that I had this, earlier this week, and this is kind of a serene sort of um, feeling to get up in the morning and just get some of the stuff done first thing. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, we'll see what goes forward from here. But just very, very happy to have had um, this nice, quiet morning. And yeah, I got a couple of submissions off. I, I, I submitted to a couple of magazines. Uh, hopefully this story will be picked up. <laughs> it was the one I talked about yesterday that that about the um, the child going back to uh, or going back to his, see his his mother's um, family. 
So hopefully that one, because that one seems to get the most traction. If I figure if I just keep submitting that one off, eventually I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a bite. Like it seems it seems like that one's the one that people or these magazines take the longest to review. That's probably in their consideration the longest. So why not um, just kind of spam everything with that, right? Just send that one off to multiple places that are at least you know somewhat reputable that they'll at least pay me a couple bucks for it and see what happens. So here's to hoping that happens. Uh, fingers crossed there, and yeah, I'll be uh, back tomorrow.